Known in Europe as the Mayer Norton theorem, Norton's theorem holds, to illustrate in DC circuit theory terms, see that image, any linear electrical network with voltage and current sources and only resistances can be replaced at terminals AB by an equivalent current source Eno in parallel connection with an equivalent resistance RNO. This equivalent current Eno is the current obtained at terminals AB of the network with terminals AB short circuited. This equivalent resistance RNO is the resistance obtained at terminals AB of the network with all its voltage sources short circuited and all its current sources open circuited. For alternating current AC systems, the theorem can be applied to reactive impedances as well as resistances. The Norton equivalent circuit is used to represent any network of linear sources and impedances at a given frequency. Norton's theorem and its dual, Thevenin's theorem, are widely used for circuit analysis simplification and to study circuits' initial condition and steady-state response. Norton's theorem was independently derived in 1926 by Siemens and Halsky researcher Hans Ferdinand Mayer (1895–1980) and Bell Labs engineer Edward Lowry Norton (1898–1983) to find the equivalent, find the Norton current Eno. Calculate the output current, IAB, with a short circuit as the load meaning zero resistance between A and B. This is Eno. Find the Norton resistance RNO. When there are no dependent sources all current and voltage sources are independent, there are two methods of determining the Norton impedance RNO. Calculate the output voltage, VAB, when in open circuit condition i.e., no load resistor, meaning infinite load resistance. RNO equals this VAB divided by Eno, or replace independent voltage sources with short circuits and independent current sources with open circuits. The total resistance across the output port is the Norton impedance RNO, this is equivalent to calculating the Thevenin resistance. However, when there are dependent sources, the more general method must be used. This method is not shown below in the diagrams. Connect a constant current source at the output terminals of the circuit with a value of 1 ampere and calculate the voltage at its terminals. This voltage divided by the 1A current is the Norton impedance RNO. This method must be used if the circuit contains dependent sources, but it can be used in all cases even when there are no dependent sources. Topic. Example of a Norton equivalent circuit In the example, the total current I total is given by I T O T A L equals fifteen V two K Omega plus one K Omega one K Omega plus one K Omega equals five point six two five M A Display style I underscore mathem total equals fifteen mathem V over two mathem K omega plus one mathem K omega one mathem K omega plus one mathem K omega equals five point six two five mathem ma. The current through the load is then using the current divider rule I N O equals one K Omega plus one K Omega one K Omega plus one K Omega plus one K Omega I T O T A L display style i underscore mathrm no equals one mathrm k omega plus one mathrm k omega over one mathrm k omega plus one mathrm k omega plus one mathrm k omega c d o t i underscore mathrm total equals two three five point six two five 
m a equals 3.75 m a display style equals 2 thirds c d o t 5.625 mathrm ma equals 3.75 mathrm ma and the equivalent resistance looking back into the circuit is r n o equals 1 k omega plus 2 k omega 1 k omega plus 1 k omega equals 2 k omega Display style R underscore mathem no equals one mathem K omega plus two mathem K omega one mathem K omega plus one mathem K omega equals two mathem K omega. So the equivalent circuit is a 3.75 milliamperes current source in parallel with a 2 kilo ohms resistor. Topic. Conversion to a Thevenin equivalent A Norton equivalent circuit is related to the Thevenin equivalent by the equations R T H equals R N O Display style R underscore erm TH equals R underscore erm no V T H equals I N O R N O Display style V underscore erm TH equals I underscore erm no R underscore erm no V T H R T H equals I N O Display style FRAC V underscore erm TH R underscore erm TH equals I underscore erm no Topic Queuing theory The passive circuit equivalent of Norton's theorem in queuing theory is called the Chandy Herzog Wu theorem. In a reversible queuing system, it is often possible to replace an uninteresting subset of queues by a single FCFS or PS queue with an appropriately chosen service rate. Topic. See also. Ohm's law. Milman's theorem. Source transformation. Superposition theorem. Thevenin's theorem Maximum power transfer theorem Extra element theorem <laughs>